do you think about um, Jamaican Canadian art, Jamaican Canadian writing, Jamaican Canadian music? Sometimes that's a little bit of a misnomer in my sense because what happens is that you are Canadian writing or painting from a Jamaican perspective and sometimes you're a Jamaican who has had the influence of Canada. And for me, art has no boundaries. So I, I am happy to designate the Jamaican Canadian because it's important that we do that and Canada allows us to do that. At the same time, the festivals that happen in, in um, Canada and in Toronto and all over hark back to a culture. We have many, many in Toronto. I think of Jambana, I think of the Irish Festival at Harbour Front, um, the Irish Food Fest, um, the, the cricket. Cricket is, is something that we got from our colonial masters and we love. And you'll find Jamaicans playing cricket all over the place. The, the other festivals that come to mind, of course, Caribana, the big one, there is Jamaica Day, and I don't know if you know, but um, during the, the civic holiday weekend, which is also Jamaica Independence Day weekend, there is always a flag raising ceremony at City Hall downtown. There's an independence service, and it's not a festival per se, but it's all part of the culture. And um, there is this thing that goes around. Jamaica has the most churches per capita in the world. And that is very much part of our makeup and of our psyche. Um, the one to three weeks, the two to three weeks around in Caribana, I think just about every corner of Toronto and the GTA has something that is of a Jamaican flavor. And we have um, insinuated ourselves in Canadian culture as we are allowed to do, which is wonderful. And I don't think there are too many people who haven't had a Jamaican patty or jerk chicken or jerk pork. And when it comes to reggae, which is the music of the heartbeat, um, it permeates worldwide, everywhere. And so celebrating Jamaica culture in Canada is in some ways easy to do. It's easy to do. We are proud to be Canadians and we are very much aware that we were formed in Jamaica and uh, quite frankly when I go about doing my business and somebody say where are you from I, I am a Canadian of Jamaican heritage and um, that is something we have to say thanks to Canada for and that is one of the reasons for Jamaica 50 wanting to bring up an art exhibit here because that is a way for intercultural communication to continue to get better as we understand more of each other. And uh, yeah, lots of festivals, lots of culture. Um, more importantly, Jamaica 50 wants to share it with our fellow Canadians.